church like for such a long time, so I cannot remember exactly. Okay. The only good thing about Easter is that it ends. <laughs> <laughs> I called him three times and I couldn't reach him. Ah. <clears throat> did I did I wake up early for nothing? No. No, I mean if he doesn't show up, we're gonna we're gonna start him. I can we'll cover his character him, until he gets here like I normally do for other people. I don't mind. <clears throat> I can try calling him one more time. Yeah, if he's not here by 10, we'll uh, start. <clears throat> In the meantime... Where are we? <clears throat> that was the bandit camp. Yeah. called him five times. I think six. Five or six. Hold on. So, I don't know. It was a lot, so. I didn't get a single answer. I just went straight to voicemail every time. Oh, shit. I didn't realize I had deafened myself. Um, I called him, like, a lot of times, and he didn't answer. Yeah. All right. I'm sorry. <clears throat> oh, no, looks like someone is asleep. Thanks for trying. <clears throat> I'll let you know if anything pops up on my phone, like if he messages me back or anything. Shaftasic is on. What's going on? Yeah, RESP League. Oh. RESP League. Just uh, another thing for Gals to win. <clears throat> <laughs> Do I smell a rivalry? No, actually, I'm really happy for the guy. He's been working really hard. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Uh, young Sweet. He's he, a might, uh, hmm. he might join the QPL this season. Oh, nice. Oh, yeah. <clears throat> Hi, kitty cat. I am uh, being surrounded by furry companions. 
You can't go with us. There's bandits. Yeah. You're not allowed. Oh, and he's playing against stone. No, no, I think that's a highlight. Oh, that's a highlight. Damn, I'm too out of it now. <clears throat> I'm, so, I'm slowly turning Korean. Or maybe not, I don't know. Because <clears throat> it's written uh, chain versus dunches around the bottom. Wait, what? <clears throat> so I oh, think... yeah. Damn, stone still looks good. <clears throat> right, I'm gonna get a glass of water and then we're gonna start. Okay. <clears throat> I tried calling him a couple more times just to see if maybe I'd wake him up, but no. Eight, nine, ten, let's see. <clears throat> All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight, seven, eight, so... Let's see. Uh, last time, you fought the bandits that were attacking Oleg's trading post. Well, not really attacking, but uh, <clears throat> stole from them. And uh, one of them that you let live uh, and revealed to you the position of their camp. <clears throat> so you decided to go there. And you reached the camp. In the meantime, you had also seen a few wanted posters uh, <clears throat> to kill um, bandits, uh, kobolds, and Tusk Gutter, which is a giant boar, and bring proof of their deaths. You were also asked if you could to bring back. Uh, Svetlana's ring that was stolen that was stolen by the bandits. <clears throat> you arrive at the camp. Um I think you hadn't decided yet what to do and when to come in exactly, so I'll let you decide all this. Yeah, we hadn't decided anything, we just showed up. <clears throat> exactly. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna flank them. Wait a second. <laughs> oh, there's Valen. I don't know why, but on my screen I didn't see him for a second. Or maybe I'm just blind. <clears throat> I think I'm just blind. Okay. Do we, do we want to approach them? Obviously, we need to sneak. Yep. Because we, we if we get sneak, that jump yeah. attack, then uh, maybe we can get an edge on these guys. Now, the other bandits weren't crazy strong, but that one lady is supposed to be super strong. So I say that we focus her first. Yeah, we can, we can barely see them. I don't know how many of them there are, but... Um... I don't either, but I just know that the trees over there. I just know that there's one specific person that is considered the threat. Is what I'm saying. And if Maybe. it's anything like the last encounter, the the main threat in that group gave up after we wiped his lackeys. So if we just take her out, yeah, I feel like it won't be much of a threat for the rest of them, no matter how many there really are. You know, I don't expect there to be a massive army of bandits because they're bandits, but. I still think the the one we have to worry about is going to be the leader, the one that they were yeah. afraid of. It can be a similar situation that in the Aldori Manor, when the lady was like super tough, and later, like after she died, it was like okay, they surrendered. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's my thought process. Bandits are kind of fin finicky. You saw how quickly the other guy turned. He's just like, "Look, bro, I'm just here to get paid." <laughs> like he left. <laughs> he just. 
Yeah. Maybe we can try before sneaking. I like. I don't know. It's just an idea. But maybe if Kit like is a little like dexterous, and if you would like, maybe we can like do a little investigation because foxes aren't very like unfamiliar in this forest. I don't know. True, but she before. is a pretty particular <laughs> fox, so there is a chance they would notice she's right. not from here. Like she's very distinctly not from this region. Ah, right, right, right. However, um, she's kind of dexterous. Yeah. She's got she's got pretty high dexterity. Can you remind me of that fox is? It's my companion. That's your companion. Cool. Oh right, you weren't here. Uh, so um, my when I arrived, I had an animal companion, but she wasn't with me initially because she had been injured whenever I first arrived in these lands, and so she was actually being cared for while we were adventuring together. And then whenever she was back at full health. She joined us for our leave of Lady Aldori's Manor. And she's just my companion now. She's not magical or anything. She's just a fox. She looks magical, but she's not. She's just pretty. Should, should be faster than me. She is very quick, and she likes to yip a lot. <laughs> likes to yeet bandits, I hope. Well, wait, don't I have something for this? Hold on, I might actually have something for this. Uh, okay, I don't have it listed in my spells or anything, but isn't there a way I can understand the fox uh, outside Omril? Uh, isn't there a spell for this that I'm... I'm not crazy, right? A spell for what? For communicating with the lesser animals? There is a big uh, No, it's a, it's a skill. The, oh, oh, shit. Okay, maybe I should look there. Um, Wait. <clears throat> there's a skill action for uh, nature, I think, is. Mm. For giving specific order to your uh, to your animal. I have command trained an animal. animal. Yeah, this command an animal. Un or untrained. So I have train. I don't think that counts, though, does it? <clears throat> yes, yes, you can uh, use it. If it... Uh, that that's just random animals. That's not. I, yeah. I think you can control your companion. Just control your companion. No, there is there is a spell called "Speak with Animals." I see on the on the uh, uh, netis. Yeah, and that's what I'm trying to look for. Because I remember seeing <clears throat> something that would give me some kind of like a communication. But I don't remember if it applied specifically to my um my fam like my familiar like you know can I control her? Yeah, I think you can control your familiar. Um, How much can I communicate with her? Like, can I get her to sneak in there and like yip at me some information? You know what I'm saying? <clears throat> um, I think yeah, you have you'd have some basic information like not as if it was a person, but yeah, okay. It, since it's a trained familiar, uh, I assume you have trained some basic actions like yep that many times for how many bandits there are, you know? True. And she's smart enough to do that because mm. she was able to communicate with uh, Svetlana. With yips. Okay, uh, then I'll do that. I also have a spell that I can just make her disappear for a while. <laughs> it's not a bad thing either. She goes into like a pocket dimension. Okay. Now she doesn't have. Actually, she has a little bit of stealth on her. Honestly, more than I was expecting. Um. Okay. So, how close do you think we can get before they notice us, not the fox? I was thinking maybe here, ish behind these trees, because it looks like it's dense. I agree, puppy. <laughs> yeah, barking at the door. <clears throat> Not at the moon. Always does. But I was gonna mm, say, well, like over time. here, to see like it looks yeah, dense we enough. There? Well, it looks dense enough. You think they'd see us? Doesn't? I don't think so. Right. What, what are you? Do? Yeah. When are you arriving, by the way? Like, you, you can choose when you arrive, when you enter the, the area. But we have to, um, to what, go. What do you mean? 
this you mean the time this of way? the day? Daytime, afternoon, uh, night. I would say evening when it's getting dark, evening, so we can get as yeah. much information as possible, and then when it's dark, we make our move. <clears throat> Evening so, is a good idea. Yeah, evening. Okay. Because we will have maybe a little bit more stealthy approach than in the broad daylight. Well, I was also thinking we could use the last of the daylight to just get what information we can and then use the information we have to make a move at night so we have even more concealment. <gasps> but will it be possible for us to see because I don't know if there is like a dark vision aspect here? <clears throat> I do have a torch on my head right now that I have to put away before <laughs> we approach. <laughs> <laughs> we are trying to sneak and later it's like we have a torch on our head. <laughs> I'm keeping this in mind. That's why <laughs> I wanted cover. <laughs> there, There is very much a torch on my head. I do have the ability to... um. Let's see. Let me let me clarify before I say this. Because um, it doesn't burn anything, though. If I remember correctly. Oh, wait. Wrong torch. Uh, I think that's the wrong torch. This is the torch. Okay, there it is. Burn torch. Can be covered or hidden, but can't be smothered or quenched. Okay. So... I'm going to just kind of stow it in my pocket, in my little pouch that I got when I gave everyone little pouches. The the tip side, so the, the fire will go out. But uh, for now, since the day's, the sun's still out, I'll leave it. But when the sun goes down, I'm going to do that. So we won't have to worry about that. Um, I can create light, but they will notice the lights. Just keep yeah, that in mind. Because I'm, I'm going to post this because... Uh, can I just post? If I click it, will it do the ability? Ah! <clears throat> do you see a full dark? It's black. I see nothing but me and Kit. Okay. Ah. Cause I'm, I'm toying with dynamic light settings, but... I'm in the darkness! I'm fine. Oh, I see is despair. I have Kit. As long as I have her, I'm fine. Yeah. Um. I wonder, if I cast Dancing Lights, I bet I can just, like, confuse them. If I cast Ooh. them on the other side. <clears throat> well, let me think. <clears throat> so if I can get close enough... Let me see what my range is on Dancing Lights. 120 feet! Fuck yeah. So here's what I'm thinking. We get close on our approach side, which would be the west at this point. I'll cast the lights to the east so that we'll see... Like, it'll be a little shadowy for us, but we will have a light source on the other side of them. So we'll have clear vision of them, and they will see the lights appearing on the other side. So they might think it's someone else approaching that direction. Good idea. Good idea. Distraction and later we are sneaking. Blam! Yeah, you guys do the blam stuff. I'll do the light. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's four yes. floating whites. Is it Hale here? Yes. What? Nice. Hale just joined. Oh, shit. Hey, Amon. Hello. Hello? Good morning. Good morning, indeed. Or maybe not. <laughs> so say we need like the cricket sound effect. <clears throat> He's completely muted. Alrighty then. Um.
it? Why is it? in the thing? Can you guys hear me? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> Can you see the map now? Yes, but I see everything. And now? Nothing. Okay, why? I don't know. It's probably because the screen is too dark. <laughs> yeah. I don't understand why it's all dark. It shouldn't be. Um, well, you know what? Fuck it. Is that? Here we go. Oh, you it's, can see? It's I can see, and it's yeah. it's the way it was earlier, where it's limited vision. Okay, good. <clears throat> All right. Um. Yep. Well, hail. I need to get some water. <clears throat> oh, okay. Um. You are uh, you're in the bandit camp during the evening as night is falling. Hello. Hello. Yes. Hello. Yeah, we're here. Okay. <laughs> now, Mihail, I yeah. talked to you. Uh, <laughs> did you did you get what I said? Yeah, you told me I'm in the the bandit camp. All right, all right. Good morning. Good morning. Um. <clears throat> the idea with distraction, we can wait and do that because it sounded quite cute. I'm gonna put my torch away now since it's evening time. I don't want. I just, I'm so afraid it's gonna give us away. So the <clears throat> torch is snuffed. Not. It's not out because it's ever burning. You know what I mean. It's 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 not bright. <laughs> it's it's cinched up in a little pouch, so it's not bright anymore. You can, I think, you can turn it off and on as uh, at will. I can. It doesn't say anything about that in the description. It doesn't. Uh. Uh. It just says an ever burning torch. Um, it sheds light constantly, requiring no oxygen, generating no heat. It can't be. It can be covered or hidden, but it cannot be smothered or quenched. Yeah. No. We can. Okay. So I just use my I little satchel doesn't... thing and put it over it, so it doesn't make light anymore. I think I have like two or three sacks, one and none of which have stuff in them. Are we sneaking? Are we? Yeah, I would say sneak. <clears throat> ah, let's sneak. Try sneaking. There's no bridge over here, right? Just, just uh, water. Is it like a deep river or just? Just very shallow. Um, it's very shallow. Okay. Let me just walk across <laughs> it. I'm gonna carry Kit because I'm short, so I can already imagine how she must feel. I'm just gonna carry her. We can go like over here and just like check the surroundings from here and have even if they'll notice us, they will have like some sort of cover, right? So True. it will be a little better. Well, I'm gonna stay over on this side because uh kit right here. I was going to send her to see if I can get, like, some information. I'm going to send her over here. You, you see, you see the, uh, do you see the bandits? Kit does, I don't. Okay, okay, but you, you have the tokens on the map, okay. Yes. 
It's okay if I send her like behind the trees over here, right? Like, do I need to roll anything or? You're all gonna roll um, stealth initiative for now, and you'll act in turn. Oh, so we're in combat now. Uh, encounter mode. Uh, what does that mean? Just so I. Well, know. it's not exactly combat, but uh, you're not in exploration mode anymore either. It gotcha. might turn into combat. Where'd my roll go? Let me cross the river then. Oh, there it is. <clears throat> so I did my initiative. Now I'll do uh, still. A perfect roll for Valian. And it will be my only 20. <laughs> Alright, so I got uh, good like rolls. It. I'm good. My uh, my thing didn't pop up, but it says that I rolled initiative. Like it's still listed under Iru. Uh, yeah. Uh, you rolled perception initiative, not stealth initiative. Oh yeah. Um, well, I thought I rolled initiative well, initiative yeah. because I clicked initiative. Yeah, you have to select the right skill. But there's a text. Oh, the side of gotcha, box, gotcha. Yeah, I forgot about that. Since you. Your first roll was 17. Oh, well, the, you rolled 17 again, so Boom. good. It's 23. Oh, wait, I, I also did like. Wait, it still didn't show my little. My icon still didn't show up. It gave it to Kit. Oh, wait, what? No, because Kit also did 23, I think. Well, did so, no, no, no. I rolled stealth. Like, I rolled the actual perk, like, the actual skill of stealth. That, that's what that worry, is. Like, you're keeping your. Uh, your 20. Oh, you have a better stealth than perception, actually. Well, one of those has to apply to Kit. <laughs> one of them has to apply to me. So, hold on. Uh, she stole my rolls. Little shit. Can I... At a turn... You were at 23, I think? The... Yeah, that's what I rolled when I rolled the proper initiative. Yeah, and kids. There we go. Works for me. Okay. Did Hale roll? He did yes. 20. Okay. That's stealth. Thing we're gonna add turn. But that's not the initiative roll, that's the stealth. That's what I did. Uh, uh, yeah, it, how do you the... roll stealth initiative? <laughs> you go to your character mm -hmm. sheet, and next to initiative, you have the right skill to select. Uh, oh. So you select stealth and you roll stealth. Okay, 26. Damn, you all rolled high this time around. Finally! Okay, so let's see. For, uh... No, is that gonna... So... <clears throat> as you approach, you can see that the the bandits uh, in the clearing uh, here. Okay. They're asleep. <clears throat> and so they'll be. Well, they're asleep. You haven't woken them up. Well, Kit's being quiet, luckily. Yeah. And so. Do you see. Do you see over here? No, not really. I see, like, s the outskirts of what looks like a possible wooden structure, like the border of it, but there's a black square over what it is. I don't yeah, okay. It. Ah, okay, so it's blocking you, which makes sense. So you can see it's, um... There's something. It's some kind of, uh... Uh, I can uh, see things, but I don't know if I'm supposed to be able to see that far. Yeah, yeah, you're supposed to. It's okay. Oh, really? So uh, yeah. I, 
I mean, I see somebody here. Well. Yeah, 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 that's normal. Yeah. What your elven eyes are seeing. Well, technically, Hale's... Emlyn doesn't see them because there's trees in the way. <clears throat> yeah, but he, he has a slight uh, uh, line of view. True. Can I see, hit him with yeah, an arrow? There are, uh, well, you're probably out of range. And I'd make that a hard shot because uh, <laughs> oh. it's, it would be very... What is my bow range? I think it's 60. Oh. How did you... So, yeah, you, you see way. a you see a watch post here. Mm -hmm. That's what's blocking you is a watch post. Okay. So Kit can't run back to me right now, no. Well, um, she could, I guess. Well, because that was all she was doing was going to go see what they were doing and come back. Okay. That was the yeah, initial yeah, order. Can, um... All right. How many were there? How many did she see? She saw four. So she yips four times, and then she rolls over, like she's like acting like she's sleeping. And I'm like, okay. So there's four of them, and I don't think they're very active. But I don't completely speak fox. <laughs> well, yes, I do. <laughs> yes, I fucking do. Oh, yes. Okay. There's four of them sleeping over there. According to Kit. Okay, so we have... And she does like them silent little yips. She's like, yip, yip, yip. Uh, she's ninja huh? yips. Because she's goofy. Because they're actually... Okay. Your turn to act. Valen. My turn. Uh, I will... Uh, you said she's over here somewhere and four people somewhere, right? That's what Kit saw. Uh, she saw four people. There's no specification of what people there were. If I would like to go through here and kind of like flank them, I would need to like go and um, jump over this tree um do you I, I don't think so let me check now nah, you can just walk over them okay so i'm motioning like maybe not motioning i'm whispering to team like uh, if they are okay with me going like and flanking them from the down over here. I just do like a be careful nod. <laughs> I will try. I hope my goddess will uh, keep me in her protection. <laughs> okay, so I will try to go. I have 25, so I'm moving like in the battle. Mm. Yes. Okay. So it will be... Uh, I don't see the grid. Hold yeah, on. me as well. That's why I'm asking. So I will like be perfectly on the tree if I would like. One, two, three, four, four. Okay. Let okay. Me... You have another action and... I'm also gonna be doing this. And... Oh wow! Oh wow! Okay. Uh... <clears throat> so... You... Uh... No, for now, for now you're good. Finish. Uh, what... uh, go, go play. Play your turn. Okay. Uh, what is over here? That's another uh, watch post. Do I see some light? Hear some voices? Uh, yeah. hmm. Roll perception. Uh, 
Okay, you see there's a bandit on the watch post. Oh no! Uh, do my party see me from this from this uh, distance? I think Jones can. Yeah, Jones can. Okay, so I'm motioning to them. Uh, like uh, Valen is like motioning in the direction, showing like big tower and a guy. He, he he doesn't see what weapon he has, but he's motioning a bow, just a bow that there is a guy with a weapon there. I'm just imagining Valen's little like point 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 tower motion bow motion. <laughs> <laughs> Similar like this. It's like charades. <laughs> And is he looking in my direction? Yes. Or, uh, <laughs> can I create a distraction so he will look in other direction? <laughs> You'll have to wait for my turn to go through with the plan, which was to do exactly that. Oh, okay, okay. So, okay, 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 okay. So you that was can, the. You can try, but. No, 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 no. I will, I, I will go with, 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 with Aris plan. That's, that's right. Okay. Uh, I can I ready my action? Uh, yes. That's uh, wait. Ready is. Uh, uh, because I mean, like, can I, for example, ready if something will happen, I will do it. Like, not to do. Uh, now but later yes, there's um it's 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 an action called ready actually i have to i don't remember how many actions it is exactly two i see two okay okay, okay. great 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 okay yes Let you can uh you have to tell me what will trigger your action uh wait 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 i will quickly read it um Choose an action you can perform and trigger for that action if the trigger occurs before the start of the action. Uh, okay, uh, I will uh, move closer to the, let's say, those bandits. Uh, if uh, I'll hear Eru doing a distraction. Okay. Okay. I think it can you tell how far right. that is. So. Next, oh fuck yes, is uh, hail. Okay. What do you do? Uh, is this bush? Um, looks like trees. I think that, no, that trees. Can I is hide this... behind the tree? Uh, yeah, you could. And can I peek to Wait, see? Did, did, what's you, did you move? No, don't move, don't move, don't move. Oh. Go back to where you were initially, please. Okay. You're in encounter mode. It's like as if you're in combat mode, except you're not fighting yet. Okay. You were there initially? Yes, I was up here. Okay. So, if you want to go to the tree, you need to use two actions. Because it's a bit um... far. You can go up to 50. Okay. I with two will... actions. Go here. Okay. And I will cover behind the tree. Okay, you take take cover. You use the take cover action. And do I see anything? Or well, do I have to. Is that another action for me to? Uh, see yeah, you you'd need another action to peek. You can peek and get back behind the tree, but you need to do an action. Um, how detrimental is it for me to peek? Like, am I still covered in this area? Or well, you're not... still covered by the tree, but taking the action of taking cover uh, increases your um, the bonuses of the cover. It's like you really take you really make an effort to actually be covered by the tree instead of just being behind the tree. Okay, so is this closer? Can I do that here? Wait, hold on. Um, do you want to move here? Let's let me see. It's two actions. Well, you're far from the trees now, so. But it's still no, two it... actions. 
Yeah, it's still two actions because you're here. And that's 30. See, you'd have to go here or here to do only one action. Hmm. Okay, then I'll I'll do that here. Okay, and then? Um... I will see if there's anybody around me. Okay, what do you see? You have the vision of your token, basically. You are blocked by whatever blocks you. Oh, okay. Then I only see this person. Okay. And I guess that's it for now. Okay. Next is Eru. Okay. Um Okay. Uh, shit. I was muted on the thing. Anyway, yeah, dancing lights. But, um, how am I hearing myself? I don't know. I'm just hearing you once. That was weird. I was, like, hearing an echo. So. <clears throat> the bandits. But, yeah. I'm, I'm gonna do it at the full length. The one, the 120 feet. Not... Not the 90 that it says. Because I want it to look like there's a group approaching them from the other side. Okay. And, yeah. Okay, they all wake up to, uh, to the lights. And they look the other way. Cause the, yeah, well, would they wake up to the lights? Because they're kind of far. They're farther than we are. Oh, they are? Yeah, they're okay. like they're, way farther. Because we're only 45 feet away. They're yeah. uh, like 100 feet the other direction. Okay, well, yeah, they made great rolls. So yeah, they, okay. they do manage. Well, that's two actions. I can sustain it, but I'm just going to kind of... Let's see. One, two... <clears throat> whoops. Two, go back over there, kid. Three. Two. I'm gonna get over here. I think that's twenty-five. Yeah, that is. I'm not like I can stand there, right? Like I'm not like in a tree. I'm like next to um, it. I want to get just next to the trees. Which spot would that count I think, as? I think you should be able to. Yeah, because as gotcha. long as you're not blocked by something, you should be fine. I think. Okay. Then your, yeah, your movement is restricted, right? You can't move through a tree. Uh, to my knowledge, no. Uh, try it. I mean, I can do this. Oh yeah, no, I can't go in it. Yeah. Okay. So it's fine. Oh, okay. Good. Uh, that's all I can do because I think that was two actions to cast that. Uh, it says one action, but I don't know because I it throws me off again. Um, I know you explained it once, but how do you determine how many actions it is? Um, <clears throat> sustaining a spell is an action, so if you want to be, um... Well, I meant, like, how do you tell how many it is to cast it whenever you're looking? Uh, on the top there's written one action at the moment. 
unless you have uh, haven't entered the right amount of actions. Well, what I'm saying is on the thing it says cast and it has some diamonds next to it, but it doesn't tell me how many actions it takes. Oh, because with diamonds, it's the uh, if you are having like dancing lights and you have like this diamond, this is one action. If you have like another like a little arrow on the right, it will be two actions, and two such arrows, it's three actions. Yeah, uh, it's actually two actions to cast the spell, Dancing Lights. Uh, th that's what I was asking, is because I, when I look at the site, I have a hard time determining how many yeah, it says. And, and if the diamond will be like a not full color, it will be just the frame, it means it's free action. Yeah, and the arrow... Uh, is there anywhere the that explains that? No, it's free action. Well, um... Like, is there in a the spot that it book, shows that? Most most spells are two actions unless specified otherwise. Yeah, but is there anywhere that specifies how to read the archive diamond um, shit? I guess there is. There's the core rule book that explains this as well. Oh, okay. It was a, uh, wait, wait, I I I have it open, so I will look it up and and put it for you. Because I don't see like it was. That's what throws me off is when I look at archives, I don't see anything that explains what those mean, and um, I just never know what to put because I forgot that by default it was two. Okay, uh, I'm guessing maybe in the so... rules. I have it. it. Uh... Wait a second. I so I don't have to sustain it in the same turn I cast it, correct? I sustain it next no. turn? Yeah, you can sustain it next so turn. So my movement still was good, and i that's all of my turn. Yeah, yeah, that, that's your, uh, your turn, yes. Okay, okay, just wanted to clarify. Okay. Alright, so... Jones, your turn. My turn. Um, what is the plan again? I use the lights to distract them, and uh, y'all do your thing. You, you shouldn't be able to tell him again. <laughs> True, I'm no, on the other okay. side of a tree. <laughs> it's uh, it's Kit, okay because it's been, it's been a while. Kit yips at him and uh, he vaguely understands it. He, he's used to barking. It, she, uh, yeah, okay, looks yeah. Like, looks like from this side I won't be able to close in on them too much. So 25 feet will allow me to get here. Thank you. Sorry, I saw the thing in Discord. So I'm gonna get here. I'm gonna pop Black Adder Venom. Okay. On my on the bow or, or is it sword? Uh, I'll do it on the sword. Okay. Uh, uh, on, on the short sword. Unfortunately, I don't think I can do it on the unarmed fist. No, you can't. <clears throat> All right, Kit. Kit's done. Ah, uh, let me see. I know she can do stuff. I just don't know what she can do. Uh, okay, not a lot she... of stuff. She's just a fox. Cool. Yeah, she can move and attack pretty uh, much. Let me make sure that I know. Because she has the same movement as me. Where do I see that? Uh, where do I see my movement? I don't see my On speed. On the character sheet? It's, it... it's above your strikes. Under your yes. DC class. Under what? 40 uh, feet. I, you have ability scores on your left, class DC, and speed. Ah, there it is. Yes, thank you. I, I just couldn't figure out where it was. And then every... Y'all were, were talking at the same time. I was just getting confused. Sorry. Uh, okay, so, but she can go farther than me. Yeah, she can. She Let's has see. 40 feet, so... Four legs. <laughs> a foot for a leg. <laughs> uh, I might... <clears throat> I might have her go over here, because they're not looking, so they can't exactly see her. And she's a fox. She'll blend in pretty well. Okay. Sorry, I choked on my coffee. Um, and then let's see. So she can do two movements, technically. No, she can do three, because she's not doing anything else. So, could I get her... Should I see her if she went that way? 
I'm just gonna get her, like, over here by the bandits, since they wouldn't notice her, because she's behind a tree, and they're looking, like, that that way. Yeah, but she's moving, she, she's still moving towards the, the space. So, Not true. Be, between, between the moment she's here, and between the well, moment her she's, first here, one, yeah, she's she here, she goes through every square, and they can't notice but they're looking this way. Why would they look? I guess. Yeah, I'll but just... there's movement. There's. A I'll bit just of put noise, her. You know. I'll just put her behind the tree and leave her there. Okay. All right. She doesn't do anything. She it? just waits. Okay. So, uh, this one does nothing, and this one, you hear coming from here, uh, a big bang. And the bandit shouts, Intruders! Intruders! Can I make my red Reddit action? Yes, before yes, that? do your Reddit action. Okay, so movement. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. And now. Wait, he saw Valen through your... a tree? Well, he's on. Uh, he's a bit high. Gotcha. Yeah, he was on the tower, <laughs> bastard. Yeah, and he, he like, critically succeeded at the... Uh... Yeah, <laughs> oh, shit. He, like, throw at me. <laughs> so... so... I'm gonna put them in the right order. So yeah, they all they don't have their weapons in hand because they were uh, they were asleep. The lights are still there. Yeah, so. the lights are still there, but now it's veiling it's your turn again. Ooh, okay. All right. Wait a second. Because right now they know I'm here, right? Yes, yes, now the, they've turned towards you. I think what they see is... Uh, they don't see Kit. I think... Can I can I get the vision of this token? Oh, oh guys, by the way, because I don't know if you write, wrote it down, but we ate those hearty meals, so we have, we have plus one f for three turns for our saving throws. Oh, right, yeah, I forgot about the meals. Oh, wait, I'm the one that cooked it! What? Huh? Who can see... Hale, can you see a uh, Kressler? See who? What? Uh, the, 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 the bandit. Yes, the uh, bandit. Not anymore, no. No, okay. Okay, so she... She only sees Valin, okay. <clears throat> so, okay, uh, Valen, your turn. Oh no, you told it in this way, like, target acquired! <laughs> Pretty much. Wait, oh, ah. shit. Ah. Sorry. The you tree's eating Valen! No! I was here, 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 here. Okay, yeah, I just wanted to check the distance. Okay. It's uh, your turn. Okay, uh, I will... Try to uh, bow mo, bow mo. Uh, you know what? I will try to bow mo the guy. Okay. Uh, uh, okay. Uh, bow mo the guy. So it is uh, diplomacy. Yes. Against his will, DC. Uh, Um, it's a critical success. Ooh! So he has minus three to perception and will for one minute. He has minus one will. That's beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. And I'm getting panache. And with that panache, I have plus five to my movement. So I think right now I will 
I will get to the lady in one move. Yes. Okay, so I'm going to the lady. I'm, I'm in the middle of the battle, but I don't care. Uh, <laughs> get him. And, and I'll try to attack her. Okay, good. So that's a hit, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that's a hit. Okay, okay. So sure. Okay, so you deal eight damage. Nice. Bam. <clears throat> you uh, you wounded her uh, pretty well. And uh, is that your turn? Uh, I think that was all. Bow more yeah. movement and attack. Yeah. No reaction. Uh... I I don't I don't have uh, reactions. I think. Okay. No free actions. Uh... Oh no 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 free actions. Okay. okay. <laughs> Uh, hey, on your turn. Okay. Uh, so, do they see me? Is there any sort of advantage from my position right now? Well, if you don't see them, usually they don't see you unless they. I specify that they have high ground and they see you or something. If I peek to see them, do they immediately see me? Like, well, you are not going to be able to because you have trains in your way. Here by where Kit is. Where who is? Oh, okay. Um, well, you you can still peek, but you're behind the you're still behind the tree. Why do you want to get out in the open a bit? Um, so I can't attack from this tree, correct? Um, yeah, okay, yes, you can. I can? You can, you, ha you have okay, to use well. an action to peek and get back behind the tree, so, but you can. So, I move here, and I will attack with my bow. Okay. I see a bandit here. Okay, uh, go ahead. Roll. Um, how much do they have? It's a miss. Great. <laughs> um, is that it for me? Did I use everything? Or um, yes. Okay. Well, I guess that's my turn. You... All right. So. It's Crescent's turn. So how does she fight exactly? I hope bad. <laughs> um, so she has, <laughs> she has to take out both her hatchets because she uh, she didn't have them in hand, and she's gonna do that. What is she gonna do? <sighs> Two strikes at the same target with multiple attack penalties. So okay. Okay. Nope. Nope. Okay, that's her turn. Eru, your mm. turn. Let's see. I'm gonna run over by Kit. It's my first turn, and that should give me visual range to everybody. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I can't see Amon. Where is he? I saw where he went. I just didn't. Uh, right next to Kit. Behind the tree. Oh, okay. Okay, if he's right there. They know he's there because he did the thing. Um. Okay, so they probably see me at this point. What's my range on this? Ugh, too close. Okay. Um. Uh, let's see. Alright, I don't see the grid, but if I do something here, they're all these three are all adjacent, correct? 
If I did spout. Yes. Okay. I'm gonna do that then, because it's probably the best thing mm -hmm. I can do right now. I'm gonna do a dead center of all three of them. Okay. Yeah, you hit everybody. They have to do a reflex save. Or are the reflex saves? I have to do it myself. Yeah. Reflex, 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 reflex it. Yeah. Okay, one of them succeeds. And... Okay, that's half damage for them. Oh my god, they are having pretty good reflexes for sleeping five minutes ago. Right? Yeah. <laughs> Shit. Yeah. Yeah, and she takes... Yeah, okay. So, the two bandits here... They got hit... Uh, no, shit. Not this one. <laughs> No, okay, actually, it's... Okay. It's Jones <laughs> doing a ruler, and I was thinking the, somebody the was sneaking behind her. <laughs> the, the oh, I'm thinking about the next term, sorry! <laughs> the two bandits here that get hit fully. Okay. Um, Presley manages to dodge it a little bit, she, she still gets hit. Um, okay. Is that your turn? Uh, yeah, that's all I could do, because it's two actions for okay. spout. Jones, your turn. Uh, I put the poison on the bow or the sword? You put it on the sword. Ah, damn. Because I can see this, uh, this bandit. Yeah, you can. Uh, I mean, if it's on the sword, I guess I'll move. So it's 25 feet. This way. So this is one action. Yeah, he's, on the wa he's on the watch post, so you'll have to climb it. If you want to attack this bandit. Ah, and it's 25 feet here. So, I guess another action. Come here and... Uh, what's the climbing check? Uh, athletics. Athletics. Oh no. You do climb it. Nice! Oh, I climbed it! No? Yeah, yeah. Uh, I do not have action as well. Nope. Throw him! <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now it's this guy. <laughs> it was kid like yapping. <laughs> <laughs> okay, he's gonna he's gonna run to no wait, they have range attached, don't they? Oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, they do they have yeah, he's gonna take out his short bow, and he's gonna attack Kitty. Okay. That's a miss, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, my AC is 18. And he critically fails. Ooh, <laughs> get wrecked, nerd. The, the, yeah, the bow string snaps. I want to verbally and yell, get wrecked, nerd. <laughs> That's Kid's turn. After she also laughs at him, I'm gonna have her... run over and bite his ankle. No. Okay. Er Fortunately, they don't have attacks of opportunity. <laughs> oh, because you're going through their... Um, through the whole area, area. You can, like, go around if you, if you want to... Because she's right here, let's see. Avoid it. Five, because you'll ten, be going through there, but five, over here you are going through it. When you are going see, through then here. then 20... Well, that's what I'm saying, she was right here where Hale is, so... If she just moves over, goes this way, that's 25. She could technically go around them and still be within her movement. She would just have to deal with a brush. I think that's 40 if she's right here, let's see. Five... 25. Yeah, that's 30. There it is. Okay. Uh, roll attack. Let's see. 
She's got... Oh, that's me. <clears throat> and she does not have unarmed fist. She definitely has paws. And jaws! Let's go, little girl. Bite him! Bite him like a monkey! I think that's a miss. Yeah, that's a miss. Well, she still has another action, right? Yeah. Bite him again like a little monkey. And that's a miss. Damn it, kid. Well, she still has the passive, so that works. Okay, so... Those were just warning bites, you know? Those are, those are warning nips. Warning bites. Nah, this, you'll get rid next time. Don't this, forget, she has this. Yes. So this guy moves here. No! He's flanking you. He ah. has to take out his, uh, his dagger. And he's gonna attack. Okay, he misses. Get out of here with this dagger! <laughs> uh, question. If yes. Kit... Like, just for hypothetically, if Kit was here, would that give her flat-footed, or does Kit not count? It counts, of course. Yeah, so counts. that does count. Okay, good to know. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, so now it's him. Uh, he's gonna take out his bow, and he's gonna try and shoot Kit. With you. She says, in Fox. 12. How Her much AC does she have? AC is 17. 17? Oh, not bad. Get foxed. And that's, that's two misses. So we both missed each other both times. <laughs> okay, so this one... I would be like, get out of here, stop here. Okay, so this one is gonna get, uh, get down from his post. He's gonna move here. And... Gonna move over there. He's trying. Okay. And the bandit in front of you yawns. Since he was uh, on watch, he already has his dagger drawn out. He's gonna attack you. That's five damage. Bam. Okay, so I had 26 HP, now I have 21. Uh, 16 doesn't hit, I think. Yeah, I have 17 armor class. Okay. Okay, so he hit uh, you once. 21 HP. Valin, your turn. Going. Mm, okay, I will try to... Oh, wait. If I will tumble through, I will get the attack of opportunity. If they have some. Uh... Uh, no, you know what I will do? Mm, okay, I will... Step here. I will... Uh, <laughs> I will bow mold this guy. Okay. Uh, okay, where is my diplomacy? Not that there's going to be an actual bonus, but Kit's going to help. Oh, it didn't work. Oh, it did well. Ah! Fuck. Uh, it's, a, it's a failure. It's a failure. Okay. Then I will just attack the lady. You can blame it on Kit. She was yapping, trying to help. Uh, sorry, That's a know. miss. I, I don't think it, it will be. It will do something. <laughs> <clears throat> okay. Uh, I'm on your turn. I'm on. Hail, you here? Hail. Hail. Oh, sorry. I don't respond to that. Um, <laughs> Apparently, you didn't respond to Hail either. <laughs> oh. No, I did. I, I heard Hail, but I, I'm not used to it. Responding to him on. Just for future um, references, with tumble through, I see that I can use it as a step, so that won't be a attack of opportunity for the future. Um, okay. Okay, so I guess we blew our cover <clears throat> already, so I'm just. No. You think? <laughs> I'll step back here behind uh, Eru and. Um... Thank you. 
Oh, I have a good question now. Uh, if I defeat the guy in the watchtower, can I stay in the watchtower? Yes. Mm. Okay. I see the gears turning and I'm afraid. Well, uh, no team kill yet. Watchtower. Who are you shooting? Okay. Is it okay? <clears throat> Your arrow strikes. He dies. Really? Wait, what? Two yeah, damage killed him? But well, he was already hit. You hit him with the puddle thing. Oh, Damn it. Right. That was. I thought it oh. would take more than that, but okay. <laughs> <coughs> and uh, I guess it, it was actually a critical hit. Oh, nice. Oh. You just obliterated him. Oh, yeah! Okay. So I, I shot... I shot him in the head. Yeah, pretty much. Um, I, I have one more action, right? Yes, you do. Nice. So I will go for the guy behind him. Uh, okay. kids. Also nibbling at his ankle with whatever that support thing is. <laughs> That's cuteness. That too, but it does give him a penalty. Uh, just speed, I think. And then he dies. Ha! Oh wow! So, uh, I have to do this. Oh K my god! Kit's yipping like she did it, but we all know who really did. It. But she's she's excited. All right, so he dead, and that's your turn. Kill just walking in, casual killing bandit. The rogue I getting killed with a bow. Them off technically, but. Okay, so Crossley is still in front of you, Nighty. All right. All She's right. gonna go with her hatchet flurry. All right. So. All right. No. Oi! 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 Ow! Ow! Twelve damage. Um. <clears throat> so. Uh, so that's a crit, so this... You need to make a fortitude saving throw. Uh, okay. Or become I clumsy? Have... <laughs> I have char charmed life, so I have plus two and plus three, four from the meal. Okay, go ahead. As well. Okay, fortitude. You succeed. Yay! What, what she was trying to do? So clumsy, um, you take a status penalty equal to the condition value to dexterity-based checks and DCs, including AC, reflex saves, ranged attack rolls, and acrobatics, stealth, and thievery. Oof. Oof. I, I got this or not? No. No, no, because you succeeded. It was 17. You had to roll 17 or higher. Oh, oh my god, so it was high. Oof. Uh-huh. Could keep an eye out for that shit. Uh, okay. <clears throat> oh, by the way, she... I can hand it up. Um, um, okay, well, she's gonna do a third attack. That's a nope. miss. And she's gonna step back. And it's Eru's turn. I stand right on the corpse of her fallen enemy. Get her! Fallen friendo. Um, let's see. I'm gonna poison her. In response to her smacking the smack out of Valen. Okay, so saving through fortitude. Ha! That's a failure. Nice! Um, initial and persistent damage. So how much? Your spell casting modifier. Uh, so that's four. Where's my modifier? That's your wisdom. Wisdom. Okay. Uh, uh, four. Yeah. Four and two persistent poison damage. That's gonna be on her. Um... <coughs> that's gonna be on her turn. So, Jones, your turn. My turn! Alright, so I will attack with 
the short sword. Go ahead. That's a critical failure. Oh no. No. Oh no. Don't That's fall down. That's an automatic fail. Uh, next action. Um. Yeah. What happened to the sword? Do I still hold it? Yeah. Yeah. You still hold it. That's a hit. Okay, and it's poison now. Yes. Uh, okay, it's to make a fortitude save. There's the uh, details. What? Oh, ah! He's not poisoned. Wow. Whoa, he is well, not. Take this, and it's another critical miss. <laughs> yes. Oh okay, well. Well, I did deal three damage. <laughs> I just Next imagine you're like flailing on top of the dead. <laughs> so, hold on, I'm gonna remove him. <sighs> Can I remove him? Yes, there we go. Uh, Kit? Kit is getting right up on her. She gonna bite her. We get to our little page. Here we go. Bite her! Revenge for Valen! <clears throat> That's a hit! Damn. Oh, they kill, actually! What?! <laughs> yes. She goes for the throat. She just jumps oh up God. on her and goes <laughs> right on the throat and just chops down on her. <laughs> That, that's even a crit, actually. Get her! <laughs> oh, yeah, she completely annihilated her. She, right, she runs up all, like a little fox, and then she jumps straight for her throat, and her jaw like clamps down on her throat, and she like, rips her. And she tears at it like right. a rock. Well, uh, okay. Uh, well, the other bandit, as he sees uh, the... <laughs> <laughs> the rabid Cerberus uh, <laughs> just ripping the throat out of of his uh, of his boss, <sighs> and uh, he just completely pales and he throws down his weapons on the ground. He's like, I surrender, please. <laughs> Kit's just wagging her little tail. <laughs> but uh, so actually, this corpse. guy doesn't know yet. <laughs> Oh no! Neither does this guy. <laughs> so it's not over, actually. <laughs> okay, so wait. This guy. This guy gonna. No, is he still alive? Not this. I'm gonna do this instead. <clears throat> okay, so. This guy's dead. Hey, this guy, what's it gonna do? Alright, he's gonna vault over this. Here. Yeah. And he's gonna, he's gonna try getting up. <laughs> and that's an athletics check. Okay, he succeeds. Like he just jumps up like a madman, and he's next to you, Yons. Oh wow, that's kind of impressive considering what just happened. Uh, yeah, they, why why not... do I know that? I know. Well, yes, you see him like jump on the uh, <laughs> on the tower. Yeah, because so... on my on my screen the tower is like pitch black. I can't see the actual yeah, tower. Okay. So oh, I can now, okay. Yeah, it's a bit heavy because the tower is small, so yeah. you're on you're on the tower, you know. <laughs> He's gonna attack you. Okay, he just missed everything. He even lost his dagger. Alien, what do you do? Uh, Valen, uh, Valen will step. I will try to tumble through this guy. Actually, he he just drops his drops. Oh, his he drops his weapon. Yeah, oh, yeah. I thought he was this one. Okay, okay. Uh, I will. I don't know. Walk to him and like kick the weapon out of his reach. Okay. 
uh, and uh, where is Jones over here, right? Yeah. <laughs> He's still it's fighting. Over there. Yeah. Because they, I... they don't see they, they don't see what happened, so Can I shout yeah. to Valen without it being my turn? Uh free free words stops. <clears throat> well, I was going to say like go for Jones and indicate that we could take care of this guy. No, okay. Yeah, that's uh, that's fine. It's okay. Uh this wasn't like a step I will just stride over here. One, okay. Three. Four, four, five. You get you can climb the tower if you want. No, no, no. One two. He's over here, right? He's on the tower at the moment. With on two the... bandits. Oh, so if I want to reach him, I need to go to the tower. Yeah, you need to climb it. Oh, right. Okay. I will try to climb it, but I will fail it, I know. Athletics. Yeah, you managed. Nice. Hey. How do I get on the tower? Uh, you are on the tower. There's not enough room for everybody. <laughs> so you're okay. like you're all you're like your four guys on it. You're like very. Uh, <laughs> there's not a lot of space there. You know. It's just... Okay. Okay. <laughs> uh, can I shove the guy out yes, of the tower? Yes, you can. You can try. <laughs> I will try to do it. <laughs> okay. So shove action. Um, um, hold on. Specialty? No, it's. There isn't shove action on the on the net. This. There's not. No. Shove. There's... Yes, there is. I think. Uh, oh, yes, okay. there is. Oh, okay. Uh, okay. Athletics check against your targets. Fortitude DC. Okay. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> uh, okay. <clears throat> Do you still want to shove him? Yep. <laughs> okay, you failed. Ah! I f that was all because I okay. think that, like, because I moved, I climbed, and I shot. Yeah. Yeah. It's uh, Hale's turn. Okay. Um. Where's that tower? Over here! Oh, that's all the way over there. I was gonna try to get in the tower because it's funny. <laughs> um, <laughs> it is! I guess not. <laughs> um, so, who's left? This guy, he surrendered dropped his weapons, right? Yeah, yeah he surrendered. Yeah, come help us! Um, come I help don't us. know who else is here. Oh, it's just the guy in the tower? This man yeah. never pays attention! I can't see. No, you can't. But you can hear. Um, what's the closest I can? Can I move here? Wait, wait. Use your you measurements. You have to calculate oh. your yes with the ruler. Where, where were you exactly? I was like okay. right. Yeah. He was there. He, no, he was next to the tree because he was next to me initially. So, and then he moved back. So he was right here. Okay. Yeah, right here. So you'd have to cross. In free action, uh, two actions, you could get here. Yeah. One more. And. Can I use my bow to shoot? I mean, is that dangerous? Because they're both in the tower? Well, yeah, it could be pretty dangerous. Uh, there hasn't been friendly fire for a long time. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's true! <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna give it a chance. Okay, make your, uh, make your roll. Oh, yay! That's, that's a hit, actually. Yay! Oh, nice. 
When Vayne okay. tried to shoot the guy, he kind of like put him for a spot for you. <laughs> okay, well, the one you sh you shoot dies. Yay! Arrow. Yeah, okay. Body, because he's there. We go like this. There's oh, sorry. Is there still one inside? Oh, there's two. How do I yeah, see that? Two. I can't. Uh, oh. you can yeah, it blocks it blocks the vision. Um, okay. I could maybe. I would I tell to the panel. Ah, I can make it transparent. That yeah. works. Yeah, there you should be able to see now. If I were you, I would surrender, my guy. Uh, he doesn't answer. Or maybe you can try to intimidate him. I'll no, give you the intimidate him for a free action. Go ahead. Intimidate him for a free action? Oh my god. Yes. Well, his friend just died, so it makes sense. Yeah. yeah. Ah! <laughs> okay, you fail. <laughs> Isn't that a critical fail? No, 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 no. It's not. No? Doesn't he get emboldened by intimidation <laughs> 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 skill? Uh, Eru, your turn. Uh, my turn, my turn. Okay. Let's see. I'm gonna tell Kit, hey, watch that guy, and she's gonna, like, yip at me in response, because she's smart like that. My movement is 25, I believe. Hold on. Let me th think. There you yeah, that's fine. Alright, I'm gonna move over to the other side of the campfire that should be within 25. And then, let's see... If I do spout, it would hit both of them. Instead, uh, it is a direct target. I'm going to cast Tangle Foot on this guy. And that should reach... Yeah, it's 120 feet, so it should reach him. And it's a single target, so it shouldn't affect them. Okay. Yeah, it's a hit. So he can't move. And it was just a regular success. Oh, he's, he's yeah. Slower. Yeah. He's, uh, I uh, can Yon's... attempt to. Valen just shrugging yeah. and like, I warned you. It's me. <laughs> it's... I just had a perfect thought for this. Let me. Uh... Uh, I guess I'll just uh, continue what I was doing. Okay, that's a hit. So he's. Don't forget have... the poison. Yes, he's gonna have to roll fortitude. Yeah, no poison. That's a miss. That's another miss. It's a beast! And Kit. Let's see. So she can go straight there and go for a climb. I'm gonna attempt to climb with her. Um, athletics. athletics. Make sure I'm on the right character sheet. Here we go. Yep, she manages it. Okay. Now, if she gets up there, is is he adjacent? Because I can't move her very much. Um. Yeah, like when I move yes, her, yes, she like yes. teleports. Yes, yes, it's good. All right, she gonna bite him. Go ahead. That's a hit. It's not a crit. Yes, it's a, it is a crit. He's flanked. Get bit. 18 damage on a crit? God damn. <laughs> oh, because it's a maximum roll. Okay, that's why. Git is like a power beast. <laughs> okay, he's dead. <laughs> so she does the same thing. <laughs> She does the same thing she did to the boss. She just goes straight for the throat. Just Arr! That poor fox is covered in blood. Alright. Now it's over. I'm gonna let Kit run over to me, and then I'm going to use the soap in my pack to start kind of cleaning her off. Before, like, Kit returned to you, like, Valen is patting Kit's oh, head. Oh, she's absolutely taking that. She's like, yeah. <laughs> Kit likes some pets. All right, she's gonna. I call her over. She needs a bath. <laughs> All right. What do you do? 
Uh, we need to. Searching. Uh, no, 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 guys. There, there. That guy's alive. Oh right. Talk to him. Do your thing. Do your thing. Don't kill him. She I yells. <laughs> and I, when the guy hears me yell, "Don't kill him," and I say this time to be even more specific, "Don't kill this one," okay? <laughs> and he hears that. And maybe don't do interrogation <laughs> punches too much. Yeah, don't don't punch him <laughs> too much. Okay, I'll. I'll... I'll let someone else. Um, While you guys start do that, I'm gonna walk we, pretty we far away. Pop, I'd pop it. Are we yeah. back in exploration mode? <laughs> uh, yes, yes. While so... you, you guys do that, since I'm aware you have very violent tendencies, I'm going to <laughs> say I leave it in your hands. Lord. Please don't kill this one. And I take Kit to the river to bathe her and get the blood off of her. Can I get myself out of the tower because I cannot move my yes. my? Yeah, I will reopen my backpack and show this to the guy. <laughs> the head. Well, is it rotting? Is it rotting yet? Yeah. Uh, it it should, is, be. yeah. should be. Should be. As I try to clean off the maggots. Ugh. Okay, so Jones, you're gonna roll fortitude. Let's see. What? Uh... Don't forget, Jones, we have a potion of lesser anti-plague, so don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys thought of me. Oh, here we go. This is what Should I... Should I roll imagined. intimidation as well? Uh, yes, you will have to roll intimidation. Oof. <laughs> okay. Uh... He 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 looks at the head a bit puzzled, <laughs> and he's like, "Is that a theater prop? A theater prop?" I I think he wants you to shove it in his face. I don't know. I'm glad I'm by the river. <clears throat> all right, kids all. Kit's all clean, so she's gonna come help with the intimidation, and I'm gonna help Balin loot because apparently Kit's okay. way more savage than me. Okay, so oh shit, I I closed the. Um. <clears throat> okay, so what do you do uh, to intimidate him now? She's gonna what, growl at do, him. Do you do you say something? She's just growling at him. She can't say nothing. I'm helping Luke. She, she looked like this. I forgot to give you the picture. Nice. Now she doesn't have a throat on her face anymore. No. Oh, that's so... what you can do. You can grab her head and use it to intimidate him, uh, Jones, since you're all into that. So you find a lesser healing potion. Okay. Um, a silver stag lord amulet. Oh, Eight. we already... Eight gold and five silver. Can I check her hands and pouches for the ring? Svetlana's ring. You don't find the ring. Can I check the other bandits as well? Yes. I do so. You don't find the ring either. You just find... Um, Wait, see. what ring are we looking for? Svetlana's the, wedding ring. The Svetlana's ring. Oh, we can ask actually the bandit. That's what I'm going to say. <laughs> yeah. I very um, angrily walk so over. Jones. And I grab him by the throat and I go, where is the wedding ring? <laughs> and I start shaking him. Uh, you find nine silver over all the bandits you search. And they all have rations for two days each. And they all have the Stag Lord amulet as well. That's what, five of each of those? Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, would you put like the the thing that the lady had because you said like some gold yes. and everything and stuff. so you have uh that's 14 in total 14 silver eight gold uh and six tag lord amulets silver they're silver That's I vote that we in. um each wear stag like extra stag lord amulets to just show that these guys are pushovers compared to us. Maybe it'll intimidate later. And a lesser healing potion. She also has hatchets and a studded leather armor. Nice. Okay. Can I wear that armor? 
Um, yeah, you could. I believe I'm already wearing that kind of armor, no? Yes. Yeah, I am. By, by the way, you need 12 strength to wear it effectively, otherwise you have a, a penalty. I have 10 strength. 12? Um, when Wait, Kit has higher strength again? than me? You little shit. <laughs> uh, what were you saying, Kale? When are we able to level up again? You'll see. I'm going to stop giving out exp again because you are about the time where you should be level 2. Okay. So that's 40 x for this fight. Okay. Uh, so are we, are we dividing the stuff later, as always? We can. Uh, yeah. Divide yeah, let, let's leave it for later. Uh, if no one else is going to take her armor, I have a question. Could I makeshift the armor into some armor for Kit? Um, it's a bit special. There are bodings for animals, so you'd need you need to be able to craft. I think. Um, can't I craft? Can't Yon's craft? You have the skill, but it takes a while, and you need um, yeah, you need the materials and uh, yeah, time and an um a workshop. Hmm. So if I carry the armor, like if I stow it in my bag, or at least some of it, could theoretically, when we get to a town, I ask Yones to do it? Like, do you have the things to do it, Yones? Or Hale? Uh, I mean, I, I don't have, have, have anything to do it. I think it's... I took crafting as just a side skill. Yeah, I have eight uh, crafting. Yeah, I think you have a kit, a crafting kit, but you need a you need a quiet place, a workshop, and. Um, a few days, I think, it would take, or at least a while. So, if I just stow the armor until we get to a town, it, it would be possible, though? Yeah, yeah, technically it would be possible. Alright, does anyone else want her armor? Because if not, I'm gonna stow some of it for Kit to later potentially have armor. I'd like it for later. I'd like to level up and well, then you can put take it. some points into strength. Okay. But uh, when you do RP, you don't say, I'm waiting to level up and put strength into no, it. I'm waiting into into until strength. I'm strong enough to equip the arm. Well, right, then you can carry it because it has bulk. Uh, sure. You, you have horses. I, I'm like, yeah, uh, horses. you, you can just put it in horses. There you go. Pouches oh, okay. or, or stuff yeah. like that. It's fine. All right. What else? Do you still have a bandit in front of you who is a bit terrified at the moment? Ask asked... him about the ring. I did. He didn't say anything yet. Oh, okay. I didn't hear uh, you. Sorry. I think everybody else. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. One at a time. So I didn't hear you ask for the ring. So I'm going to answer you. <laughs> oh yeah, I was um... shaking him, saying, "Where's the ring?" Yeah. <clears throat> a couple of bags of loot were stolen a while back by a group of filthy gremlins. I'm like, like wait! Annoying little shits live under the old sycamore tree to the east. Alright, I, I take a step back in pure disbelief. I give him a quick slap, and I go, How the fuck do bandits get robbed? Well, the same way we robbed. I'm like, Amateur! And I just walk away. I remember what he said about the location, but I still call him an amateur and walk away and kids just gonna uh, growl at him and just Vayne is going closer and like sycamore caves. What is what is it? Err. Where it is? There's a big old sycamore tree to the east and that's about all I know. Err. And you are saying gremlins, those who are like kobolds, goblins. Yes. No, gremlins as in gremlins. Okay. Do, do a nature check. I can hear this, so I can do a nature check too. Yeah. Yeah, if if you would like, I'll do it. I think it's a specific. Yeah, it's a specific creature. I think. I got low anyway. No, it's a group. It's a group of creatures. Okay. Can I do it even though I don't have nature? Yes. Uh. Might as well too, you know, just in case. More more knowledge, the better. Okay, 
Kit's still growling. She, she can't say shit. Oh, actually, I do. I have one point put into it. Okay. okay. So, um, Valen knows that there are fake creatures, but the, the cruel and unkind ones. Yeah, okay. Oh. Okay. So you can jump on him. And jump off of him. It's intimidation. Mm -hmm. She thinks she's being intimidating. She's actually being adorable. When they toll from you. What? When have they stole from you? When? Um, uh, which day? It was two days ago, five days ago. I don't remember. You're useless. I, I just yell again, amateurs! East from here, right? He said east. east. Yes. How far away? Um, let me see. I'm gonna take a look at the map because... Mm. It's like nipping at his ankles. Not biting, he's, just kind of like nipping. He's, um... It's um, uh, about two two uh two days on foot away. One okay. day on horseback. Alrighty. One day. I think that if we are this deep into helping Svetlana and Oleg, we can try to yeah, get Yeah, might that. as well. Might as well. I'm going to use my healing kit to do a medicine check for Valen. Thank you. So I think Valen and Jones are visibly hurt. Okay, so 2d8. There's seven. Thank you. Let's see. Now, I can only do one medicine check even though I have tools and the cantrip. Yeah. But okay. also knows it's, uh, you, you can treat, uh, treat him again in an hour. So. Well, I haven't used any of my spell slots. So I could do a heal burst. You could. I'll do that. Since I'm literally dead center between the two of them. Um, it'll be... Let's see... The 30-foot one. And that is 1d8, I think. Yes. Fuck. Well, there you go. That's all I could do. But Hale also has Amon uh, has also the medicine things, right? Yeah, uh, but you can't treat the same person twice. No, by no, two I, I, I was I was thinking Jones, Jones. Yeah, like yeah, each yeah. of them get a oh, little bit. Sure. Kit's still nipping at him. Arr. Because I'm already I'm good with health right now, so that's okay. Uh, I have uh, four elixirs of life. Oh, there you go. That's two d eight. Okay, but you may not need them at the oh, moment. Oh wait, did I have to roll medicine or? Yeah, no, yeah you medicine roll 2D8. is good, but you roll two d eight for how oh, many okay. health points you give back. Nice. Nice. Cool. Is that perfect? No, no, no. it's not. It's five, so five. you also got one additional point. So Yon's got eleven, and Valen got eight. Cool. I think you're full, uh, all of you, right? Uh, are uh, we? No, I have. I I'm four uh, points down, but that's okay. Yeah. All right. Okay. Well, uh, that, that's what the addictions are for then. Yeah, I'll do give you one of the answers. Do you do anything fire. else with the bandit? I'm sitting by the fire, letting them decide what to do. 
how how many points those elixirs of life are are um, only six can i have one <laughs> yes okay one d it's like <laughs> nipping at his ankle so he doesn't go nowhere he's just like flick he's like twitching his feet like yeah stop it do you need another one oh that's okay two points is okay should we tie the bandit up you didn't and she's I'm just like nipping have. at his ankles. Just uh, do we want to take the bandit to all station, the similar how we did with the last bandit? So here's my thoughts. If we do that, we're wasting time because we need to go get that treasure. There's no telling what they're gonna do with it per se. I mean, they're fake creatures, like you said. So we could be on a time crunch that we don't know about and. Taking him back would waste that time that we might need. That's true. You there, why are you a bandit? <laughs> uh, well, I kind of grew up in it. Does that really interest you? Yes, why are you a bandit? Well, life in the wild. And just uh, At first... There was nobody to answer to, but lately, uh, we all came under the yoke of the Stag Lord, and he's not a very nice man, but yes, he's sir. strong. Okay, so screw the Stag Lord. You're going to go help those innocent people that you've been ripping off to make amends for what you've been doing. And if I ever catch you doing otherwise, you're going to end up like your little boss over there. Are we capiche? Hey, sure. All right, my vote is to let him go. But before we'll do that, can you tell us a little bit more about that stag lord? Uh, he's a monster of a man. He's uh, very good with a bow, and one time I saw him crush a prisoner's hand to mush in one fist. Oh. I, I, a little monster. I'm going to call him on a... I'll be like, wait, 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 wait. So you witnessed all of this with your own eyes? Uh, yeah. Uh, and I've never seen him without his creepy stag helmet on, either. I don't know if it's his face, or if he has no face under it, some people say. But he's creepy. Uh-huh. Mm -hmm. But uh, do you know how many people he has, where he is, anything like this? You sounded like you saw him personally. Uh, yes. And I don't know how many people he has. It's hard keeping track. But uh, we use a master phrase as a sort of password to get into the f the fort. It's on the northeast shore of Tuskwater. Uh, I can show you. No, no, mm -hmm. what's the phrase first? Uh, mm -hmm. So, unless it's been changed recently, the current phrase is by the bloody bones of St. Gilmorg, who wants to know? And uh, no, I have no idea who St. Gilmorg is. Can we check if he's telling the truth? You can Sense. attempt sense motive. So it was by the bloody down, bones by the of Saint Gilmore, and now the, the, was the who wants to know a part of the catchphrase? Yes. Sense motive. Okay. Which one it was? Uh. Uh. Sense direction. Oh my goodness! Why it is sense motive direction? There we go. All right, I wrote it down. Uh, what was it? Sorry, I was writing down the thing. Uh, well, sense what? motive. Is it under? Do I have it? Sense. Uh, yeah, I think everybody has it. It's. Uh... Wait, wait, wait. I'm. I will. Perception for you and compares the result to the deception DC of the creature. No, wait. Uh, perception. Uh. I see it, but I don't <laughs> see which one to... Is it just regular perception? Yeah, perception. he's telling the truth. You think he's telling the truth. Oh. So how was the catch price? Can you tell it once again? So, um... But, but slow, I need to write it down. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm just gonna copy-paste it to you. Oh, okay, thank you. That works. By the bloody bones of St. Gilmore, who wants to know? Gilmorg.
Well, if the bones are still bloody, it still needs to cook a little bit more. That's how I do it with chicken. All right. <clears throat> was a valuable information my friend <laughs> and he's like putting a, a like emphasis on the friend <laughs> so he won't like me think about doing anything stupid uh, yeah uh, can you find it useful uh... I'm serious if you if I don't go back to that post and see you being an honest upstanding citizen sir you're gonna have a lot more things to worry about than a stag lord well, I wouldn't mind if you drop dead. I mean, we can let you drop dead. Is that is a negotiable? Uh, I, Kit growls out. Um, you want to kill the stag lord, don't you? No, I'm saying I, I yes, but I'm saying you are going to go be an upstanding citizen and help those innocent people, and I'm going to get a confirmation. And when we go back to give her that wedding ring, you're going to be there helping her. Correct. Roll uh, intimidation. Uh, da, 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 da. here we go. Oh, I exchanged that for <laughs> something else. I have no intimidation. Okay. Whoa. <clears throat> <clears throat> uh, yeah, sure, sure, sure. Okay, okay, okay. I, I will. I will. All right then. Then we have nothing further. Thank you for your help, and uh, you better be there when we get there, sir. Yes, I will. Well, I okay. promise. I promise. Okay. Can you show us where the stronghold is on the map? Uh, yes. So let me see. And uh, where is it? I can't believe I landed that intimidation check. I have zero <laughs> in my skills. Ooh, I was lucky. Okay, so I'm free. Uh, I'm going to move you to the map so that you can see. I think it's that one. Yes, it is. And it's... It's this one. Oh, I'm wow. going to mark it. It's kind of well, far. I'm, I'm going to mark it with something. <laughs> I see. You. I see. You. Thanks. Uh, it's in here. This, uh, this hexagon. Okay. Okay. And I'll... it's just north of the, um, of the lake, basically. And the Sycamore Caves? The Sycamore is... Uh, it was here. Oh shit, the color is bad. It's here. Okay. Well, my vote is to go there first. Because what we could do is go ahead and, you know, secure the items we promised we would get. Um, we can actually double back at that point if we want to to swing through the radish patch and all that uh get them what they need and then go on or we could just keep pushing forward um get the items from the little goblin dudes and then uh go to the stag lord and just you know do it all in one round and then go back through the radish patch on the way back it, it kind of just depends on how we want to play it i guess Maybe let's go first to the Sycamore Caves and let's yeah. see if they won't like kill us in the space because those are face and they can be a little problematic and we'll see maybe. I just kind of rub my hands together and say I've been working on a spell for this. Shit. I closed the window. No, shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> no, it's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Um, what were I saying? I'm sorry. Uh, that that was just saying. I I was being. I was like rubbing my hands together. Like I've got a spell for those little little faith fuckers. <laughs> All right. So should we let the dude go and head out? 
we can explore that one thing, maybe set up a camp and prepare for the next day since we're probably not going to have time to do the actual encounter. No, you don't. Yeah. yeah. So, Amon, what do you think? And um, what, what I... are we doing with this bandit? <laughs> I think we should just leave the bandit. Yeah, his fate's in your hands. I, I told him, I intimidated him into agreeing to go back and help Zetlana and her husband after all the damage they've caused, and he unwittingly agreed to it, so there is that potential that we could just send them some help, and I mean, I think they could handle themselves with a the guard against one bandit. Because the guard's there at this point, so they should be safe. Yeah, we're gonna leave him there. Mm-hmm. Like I do the little finger motion where I like point at my eyes and point at him and point back at my eyes and point at him. Mm -hmm. that. Let's just, then let's go. That's all. Uh, we ride out. All right. So uh, it's night, by the way. So maybe I'll. You would like to rest first? Actually, should we just camp at up? the bandit camp? Why not? Yeah, actually. You know what? I'm gonna too. I'm gonna invite the bandit to camp with us before he heads out too. <laughs> Be like, you know, since you're turning a new leaf, here's a good place to start. <laughs> this camp okay. is a free real estate. Oh, well, there you go. I am going to attempt to, uh, what what were the camp rules? It's one to set up, right? Or that one of the action is to set up a camp. Well, it's already set up, no? Yeah. Yeah, it's already set up. You don't need to set up the camp. I will try mm -hmm. to prepare us a meal. Which one was that again? Um... So, it's in the threads. You have cooking recipes. We don't know any, though. You know one. You know the hearty meal. Well, that one. Yeah, six, DC 16 survival. Survival, okay. Did the bandit have food? Like, can we eat their yeah. food? Two days ration uh, each. So yeah, you can eat that food. Okay, you succeed. Yay. You get uh, plus one to the next saving throw during the next 24 hours. Nice. nice. And we'll get our... I'll get my spell slot back now. Yes, you all get your spell slots and... Uh, can I actually... Daily preparations. Can I also, like, if, like, Eru right now is in the cooking zone, can because there is, like, something like hunt and gather, can I, like, hunt for the um, ingredients for her next meals? Yes. I am loaded on rations, by the way, especially considering that we just got more. Yeah, me as well. Um, the supplements from subsiding. You can use the special effects XCP. Attempt a hunting lore or survival check against the zone DC there is. But how does it play it with my forager thing? It's still like while using survival to succeed, I'm still succeeding. It's, it's the yeah. same. Yeah. Okay. But I will throw anyway. <laughs> okay. So success. Uh, so you find a number of basic ingredients equal to the zone DC plus one D4 special in in ingredients. Okay. So one D4. Uh, I'll let you roll. And how many? How many did you say the uh, number of basic ingredients equal the zone DC? It D for a uh, unique ingredient. So that's ten. So ten? Yeah. The zone DC is ten. Yeah. So oh, it the zone DC, right? Yeah, the zone DC, but there's if you're hunting and gathering in a zone that's at least level seven, increase the number of special ingredients found to D two D four. Okay. Yeah, but it's not level seven. It's okay, okay. Uh, the zone is level two. Okay. So what the, so what did we find? 
uh, well, you find special ingredients. Okay. <laughs> to, oh, okay. make, to, to uh, so you keep them because hearty meal uses basic ingredients and no special ingredients. So it could be like plants or stuff that you could use later for a recipe. I could uh, yeah. just stash them. I don't mind being a pack meal for that kind of stuff. Yeah. Okay, okay. so special that's, ingredients free. That's like all I can do is cook, even though I have and, probably and, the highest survival out of all of us. How many ingredients? Uh, normal? Ten? Ten. Okay. Uh, will so, you write it down, Kitty? Yeah, I'll add it to my inventory and my stash stuff. Um, it's special ingredients, right? Uh, three special ingredients in and ten normal ingredients. Special ingredients, and then that was three, and then it was ten normal. I'll fill that in, and then I'll go back and fill in the more. Probably not even spelling that right, but it's okay. Ten. All okay. right. <clears throat> well, you are now headed for the old sycamore. Yes. Okay. Um, we're gonna end it here. Okay. Thank you for playing. That was and, cool. Uh, yes, and uh, so next week we are not playing. No. And uh, so we'll have to find another time to play in two weeks. I should uh, be good after that. Like after this weekend. Uh, this coming weekend, because uh, I'm working an event in Dallas, and then after that, I'll be back on my normal kind of schedule for a while, so you don't have to worry about me. It's just that one specific weekend, is I just can't be there. Yeah, yeah no problem. Um, in two weeks, I'm not free on Saturday, unfortunately, on Sunday only, because there's like a D&D &D movie and we're going. <laughs> oh... So it you're looks good Sunday? Really bad. <laughs> <laughs> but still, you know. <laughs> okay, but yeah. Uh, hey, hey, hey. If you want to talk about bad D&D &D movies, watch the other D&D &D movie that exists. Yeah, yeah, they're so bad. It's so good, it's bad. It's so bad, it's good. Yeah, pretty much. Uh, I'm going to fight uh, your so... dragon with my dragon. Oh, wait, my dragon can't be a dragon because you broke the magical rock. <sighs> So bad, it's so bad. Also, the acting is bad, the jokes are bad, nothing the, yeah, makes sense. Nothing makes sense. <laughs> are you telling me that it's so bad that it's good? Yep. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm all in for it. I've I've watched it many times. It's so bad, it's good. <clears throat> it's basically you you have D and D, you have besides it was at that time I think it was uh Third version of D and D, so oh, no. <laughs> three point five or three, so pretty much like one of the best versions, if not the best. <laughs> and they decided to go with this instead of the Forgotten Realms or and something inside the Forgotten Realms. They just went with something completely made up, generic shit. <laughs> this is what happens yeah. when the writers of the D and D movie do not actually play D and D. Yeah.